Welcome back to OnlineDrummer.com. I'm Nate Brown. Today, I'm going to be going over a, a practice technique for drum fills, but it can also work as a cool solo idea, as long as you don't continue it for too long. As with the last lesson, uh, the concept is simple, and what you do in between is up to you and your creativity. The bass drum is going to drive this exercise. It's playing on the, all the one, uh. So we've got one, uh, three, and four, and three, and four, and. And in between those, you're going to be playing drum fills, ad-libbed. Could be something simple. But you can have fun with it, gradually build it up. Now, I do recommend keeping count on the hi-hat on one and two and three and four and eighth notes. One, uh. That might be difficult to do at first, but you want to build up that technique because that's a technique you're going to use all throughout the rest of your drumming career. I'm just going to goof around with this uh, technique, give you some examples. 